first time I ever heard about DJ Tabor, it was like, it was Julian, Julian Cruel. He was like, yeah, I get kept by Tabor every time. Ooh, five bucks, da, 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 da. And I was like, hold on, cuz. This nigga, he's cutting you for that cheap right now? And you getting yeah, cussed like that? Homie. I was like, oh, yeah, I need, I need that. And then and then that's when you was, uh, is that when you were at? I was in school. So you I were in, in school. barber school. Okay. And those were guys lived in my neighborhood. So they used to come to my house and I used to get them $5 designs when I was trying to work on my craft. And yeah. my, my stuff right. Mm -hmm. I would give them designs for real cheap. And obviously it would make people talk. Wow, who did that? Who did that? Yeah. That's all I wanted. Mm -hmm. And then people would say my name. Just like you just said, exactly. and then your name starts bubbling that way. That was my that was my model. That okay. Was what I was, my goal. So you've always kind of had that marketing, advertising. I, I guess I didn't know. I yeah. didn't know how 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 effective it was. Creating conversation.